One of the effects that you may use a lot is object on a path. And it works out beautiful when it comes to applying text, maybe on a circle. And we're going to demonstrate how we can put text on a circle using the effect of object on path. So how do we do this? Well, the first thing that we need to do is we need to create a path for our text to go around. And over down here, we have something on the shapes menu. Anytime you see an icon with a small little triangle down there, that means there's more options to be seen. You can left click and hold, and we now have a circle. Now on my canvas, I'm just going to click and drag. And as I'm left clicking and dragging, I'm going to hold the shift button down. That way I get a real constrained circle. So I'm going to go ahead and let go of it there. The next thing is we need to actually have our text of what we want to put around the circle. So for this, I'm just going to type out summer days are here. Okay. Now, so that we can see this, I'm going to change the color of my text to something else. So I'm going to change it to black and hit OK. So the object of path takes two things. So we need to select the text and we can select the circle. All right, so we can select both or we can hold the shift button down and click just so that both are selected. And then we go up here to the effects menu and we choose object on path. Now this window will appear if we click the auto preview, that sort of helps us out a little bit, meaning that it, any changes that we make here will absolutely appear down here in the map. We do have something again that you may play with, which is the start offset. This allows you to move the text where you would like. So maybe it's not starting exactly where you want it. And then you can also change how your text is aligned. You can say through the middle, change it to the top or bottom. But mine, I feel like it's perfect right there. And then the next thing that I want, would like to do is once I have everything OK, I'm actually going to accept all of the alterations from this menu. And I'm going to click the OK button. Now that I am finished, I can actually take away the circle that I was using for a guide. And now my text is arched the way that I wanted. And that is a real quick example on how you can put text on a path and create circular text.